First thing first, we are going to make a slip knot. Chain 4. Make the ball crochet into the first chain. Next row, chain 3. Turn your work and make the ball crochet into every stitch and we are going to increase at the end of the row. Now we are going to make 2 the ball crochet into this chain 3 stitch. For every new row, chain 3, turn your work and make the ball crochet into every stitch and we are going to increase at the end of the row. Remember, we only increase into the last stitch of the row. After you got the size that you want, stop increasing and we are going to chain one and cut off the yarn so you will got a half shape of diamond. To start every new row of decreasing size, we are going to chain two only. Turn your work, skip one stitch, 
and we are going to make the ball crochet into every stitch until you have two last stitches and we are going to decrease two in one stitch for this diamond we are going to make half side of increase and half side of decrease if you want the diamond look bigger please add more row of increase and more row of decrease remember both sides should have the same number of the row and stitches to make the ball crochet decrease yarn over insert the hook into the loop yarn over and pull through of the loop so now you have three loops on your hook yarn over and pull through of two loops again yarn over insert the hook into the loop yarn over and pull through of the loop and yarn over pull through of two loops yarn over and pull through all the loops Start from row 9 or start from the second row of decrease. This chain 2 here we doesn't count as a stitch so we are going to skip them and we are going to decrease into this 2 stitch. As you can see, both sides have the same number of the stitches. Next, we are going to make a triangle shape. Make a slip knot and chain 6.
then make the ball crochet into the third chain. So chain 3 here count as the first row and chain 3 with the ball crochet it is count as the second row. Row 3, chain 2, turn your work and make the ball crochet into the same stitch. I call this an increasing size. So chain 3 stitch here, it is the straight side, we are not going to make increase into them.
After you sew every small piece together, and now we are going to connect the front side and the back side together. If you feel too tight around upper arm here, please remove the half diamond. 